Hi, it's Julian Meller, Positive Impact Golf Coach. I'm just here at Stony Deer Park near Coventry. Um, I'm just going to show you how to play a little chip and run shot. I've got five minutes before my next lesson and arrive, so I thought let's um, let's make the most of this time and do something constructive. How many of you struggle with a shot? Hopefully you won't after you've seen this video. I'm going to demonstrate the action first and then we'll go through what I do. Okay, so this is about a 15 yard chip shot. I'm playing a seven iron. First and foremost, look how close and upright I stand to the golf ball. I've got the golf ball roughly in the middle. I'm holding it a bit like I would do my putter. So I'm holding it quite, quite a way up the, up the grip, like my putter. My feet are relatively close together, probably not much more than a club head between my feet. There's not, uh, there's not much use uh, involving the body too much with this one. So if I just demonstrate the action, hopefully that doesn't look too complicated. Um, watch the rhythm, see how fast or how smooth this action is. Funny little green this one, it's got a slope up towards the flag, so it's tending to kick it off to the right a little bit. I'll just show you another one. First and foremost, keep relaxed. If you're over the shot and you're nervous, you're probably going to be tense, you're going to struggle with it. Keep relaxed first and foremost. Adopt your putting grip, and the stroke is very simple. Just a little, really using the loft of the club to elevate it over the fringe. Get it onto the green, get it running like a putt, so you're really going to read this like a putt as well. Uh, this isn't designed to go up in the air and stop quickly, it's a chip and run shot, as it says on the tin. There's a subtle, subtle weight shift. There's a subtle weight shift on the follow through. I'm not trying to keep things too still, I'm not trying to be robotic with this one. There needs to be an element of freedom within it. What I do like about, about this shot, let's try and keep it relatively even. There's lots of talk whether we should go long and, and short or do we have a little bit of wrist break and flick it. Let's just keep it smooth. It doesn't have to be complicated, this shot. Let's just show you one more. Nice and upright. The toe of my club is actually sitting in the, into the ground. And don't, don't worry about that, it's not an issue at all. Nearly. Um, if you'd like to know anything, uh, anything else about this shot, um, by all means contact me. My uh, my details are on my website. It's juliemellagolfschool.co.uk. Uh, any queries, any questions? Ask away. Thanks for watching. Bye.